Hello, in this video I will show you how you can create a panel of histograms for a numerical variable grouped by a categorical variable either in rows or in columns or in both. Suppose that we have uh, the mathematics score for a number of students and we want to create a number of histograms grouped by gender and by whether they smoke or not. So, how to do that? We go to the graphs. One way is to check the legacy dialogues, the histogram, and from here we pick the mathematics score, we place that to the variable box, and then we, we define our panel by rows and columns or both. Suppose that we have as a row the gender and as a column the smoking uh, option. If we press OK, you see that we generated a panel of histograms where we have the mathematics score on the horizontal axis and the male and female as a row and the smoking as a column grouping. So we see here in the first, in the top, in the top left, we have male who do not smoke. And as you can see, it's pretty informative. While for smokers, we see that the number is, is very uh, limited for both whether it is female or male. We can create the same graph by using the chart builder and defining the same more or less approach. We pick from the gallery of the plots, the histogram, we drag it into the working area and then we need to define what is the variable for the for the horizontal axis? It is uh, the math score. So we drag it here and let it fall at that box. We generate the histogram, and next we need to define the panels. We go to the groups tab, and we enable the row panel. As you can see, it places a panel here in the working area. So this is a row panel variable. So let's pick uh, the gender. We pick it and drag it here in the box. And we can also define a column uh, panel variable. Uh, for our case, it would be the smoking. As you see, it has pre-generated uh, a preview of our uh, panel of histograms. Uh, we can define any details here to the right side. If we press OK, the panel is ready. So in both cases, either in the previous one or this one, uh, whatever way we use, the result is the same. We can customize the appearance by editing the plot and uh, using our own uh, preferences. Thank you very much.